This is the Creality Space Pi filament dryer. Um, it's like Pi, like the Greek letter. Um, the it's an, it has an adjustable temperature from 45 to 70 degrees Celsius. It's got real-time humidity monitoring. It has a drying time of between zero and 48 hours, and has a, like a 360 degree like circulating heat. Um, it's got some a one key um, presets for different types of filament for up to 12, I believe. So filament dryers are kind of used to <clears throat> do what, what it sounds like, dry your filament, especially for things that are attract water, like especially like TPUs, why I primarily print in, sometimes P PETG. Um, <clears throat> it, it, it's pretty straightforward out of the box, uh, what, you're, what you have here. Um, so there's no complex real setup or anything to put together in here. So I want to demonstrate just putting the filament in real quickly. Um, and then I'll kind of go through the, the menu. Um, it's pretty, pretty straightforward, so you'll see here in a second. Probably the most tedious piece is the thread, the filament through there, um, through that hole and, and through the Bowden tube. Okay. Right. So I'm just going to quickly run through the, through the menu here. So what you're going to see is it is a little tedious in touching the the touch screen there. It doesn't work exactly as, as you'd want. So right here I'm going to change the temperature from Fahrenheit, from Celsius to Fahrenheit. You just hit the temperature button up there. Um, and then <clears throat> I'm going to do a manual setting for, for TPU. And you can see here in a second. You just adjust those buttons up and down. That'll move the temperature. And then you move down to the little settings button down there, and that will allow you to to the time, and that will allow you to select the number of how much time you want. So I just set it for an hour, I believe, and then it will start counting down. You'll hear it kind of fire up. You can change the temperature on there during when, when this is taking place. And you're gonna see here in a second, I'm gonna shut it off and it's going to save the the temperature um, as well as everything else that was on there except for except for the time. So now I'm shutting it off. When I turn it back on, it's gonna see that it maintained the temperature. Um, this is like a power saving feature, so it will if it powers off, it will power right back up and continue where kind of where it left off from a temperature perspective. So now I'm going through the presets. I'm going to again select the TPU setting, and it's going to use the preset for that. And once it gets ready, then I'll just add some time to it and let it start. And <clears throat> finally, I'm going to just wrap this up with. Uh, Kind of you can hear how how well it rolls it's got a set of rollers in there it rolls really really easy um, and you'll see that here in just about two or three seconds so and you can see it's rolling relatively easy pretty straightforward um, it's loud um, but it dries really well it's the warm exterior is nice and warm so i think it works